Hey guys, it's me, Nisha. I'm coming to you with a really quick video. I know I always say that, but I'm really going to try to make this quick. I miss you guys so much. I haven't made a video in so long. As you guys know, I've been having like a sickle cell flare up for like the past couple months. So I've been up and down, up and down. So the times that I do have energy, I'm trying to do stuff with the kids or my husband or around the house. So I haven't really had time to make YouTube videos. And let me take my Bluetooth off. As you guys can see, I have box braids. I think the last hairstyle you guys seen with me was the crochet braids. And then after that, I did bantu knots. Um, and I did a video, ban uh, bantu knots on my real hair. I dyed it black. and But now I have box braids. Um, they're black with a couple um, streaks of blonde. Um, that's not what this video is about. I'll do another video on that. I have had these up for a couple weeks. My sister did them. Um, so yeah. But, I wanted to do a video on iKate House. Um, iKateHouse.com. It's kind of like an initial, uh, initial review. Like my first thoughts. First of all, it came in a package like this. And I I got some concealer, the LA Girl, whatever, you know the concealer that everybody's raving about on YouTube. So I got that. And I was I got it a while ago. And I went to open it and when I seen how cute it was wrapped, I was like, you know what? I don't care how I look or how I feel. I need to do a video on this because I was really impressed. So it came they wrapped it in a little package like this, and I thought that was so cute. Like, look how cute that is. So, it's wrapped. It has a little bow on it that says, I Kate House. Thank you for shopping. And then, it's wrapped in wrapping paper. And, I just got a couple um, of them. I didn't really... I picked a couple of them. They didn't have all the colors that I want, so I only got four. And, I'll be doing a review on these. And, I have... I've been doing a lot of stuff. Like I said, when I have been having some energy, guys. But when I do have some energy, it's not a whole lot. So, but I have tried out a whole bunch of um, makeups, uh, foundations, and BB creams, and hair products. So, I have a lot to talk to you guys about. Um, this right here is the LA Girl Pro Concealer. And I got four of them. The colors I got was medium beige, warm sand, and cool tan, and almond. So, I wanted to get some different colors. And I also seen on uh, YouTube how some girls were actually did their whole face with this. I'm trying to get into the makeup, guys. I'm not... I'm not a professional. You guys know that. But I just wanted to do a video on this to show you guys that. And it has in here their card with um, their website on the back. And you can scan it if you have the scanner app. Um, so I just thought this was really cute. I would definitely recommend going there. I forgot how much they cost. Hold on. Oh, and I've also tried a whole bunch of lipsticks, guys. So, I have a lot to review with you guys. So, these cost $1.99 each. And the shipping was $2.95. So, with all of them, I got four. $1.99 each, it equals $7.96. And the shipping was $2.95, which isn't bad. And um, the grand total was $10.91. So, I really, really like this. And then there's just peanuts in the bag as well but I really like this I would definitely be using them again because they had a lot of other things that I like to try out they had lashes and lipsticks and BB creams and foundations and all that stuff so yeah I'm definitely gonna try that again and I also want to tell you guys about the hair that I use this time I use the expressions hair and I actually cut it into three threes not twos threes I cut it into threes and then I pulled the ends, feathered the ends so that it could have this effect. And the reason the blonde streaks are a little shorter 
is because I use just regular 99 cent hair. I didn't want to buy, spend five dollars on an expression bag of hair for the blonde, the 27, when I knew I was only going to have a few in there. Like, I think I only have like six. I didn't want a lot. But I'm really loving them. I haven't been doing a lot with them since I haven't been feeling well. But I'm going to try to do a video where I show you guys some different styles. I didn't have her to braid um, my edges. I just slick them back with some eco, eco styler gel. Because as I told you guys before, my edges are really, really fragile. They have always been. I didn't do anything to make them fall out. They've always been this fine and thin since I was a baby. If you look at my baby pictures, they're the same. My mom would slick them down with grease and water back in the day. Um, so, I mean, besides one time when I got sick and some medication that I was on caused it to fall out and it grew back though so I haven't did anything to make them fall out before anybody says that oh you got your braids too tight and it made it fall no I don't they're not too tight they don't hurt I mean I can pull them up in a ponytail I could pull them up in a ponytail the first day but yeah so that's it guys I miss you don't forget to rate comment and subscribe I'll be coming up with more videos and I'll talk to you guys later bye